Hello guys, I wanted to help you to pass Volcano Challenge as other challenges without tech parts, S and even epic legend equipments. But this challenge was so easy that at first I wasn't going to make this guide. But later I got an idea. Is it possible to pass the challenge with only one normal great weapon? So guys, in this video I will show you what skills and in what order might make it possible or there's no way to pass it with a great katana. I chose katana as it does a massive damage, so you can hit many enemies. Baseball bat is also good, but for mega challenges katana is a way better. In the first 3 minutes I choose weapon and supply skills that will help me to beat bosses and survive big waves of zombies, because without the right skills the last minutes will be impossible to survive. And if you're not lucky with skills in the first 3 minutes, then there's no sense to play on. In the first 3 minutes I focus on weapon skills and I'm trying to make demon blade fast. It will really help me to survive after minute 3. Besides trying to make demon blade, I choose soldier ball as it's the best skill against mobs and bosses. Drones are very useful here, they easily kill enemies especially type A. Other two weapon skills are not very important. I got brick and modular mine, but I wanted lightning emitter instead of modular mine. Anyway, these two skills are not important. Before the first boss will appear, I'm standing here, below this rock. So when the boss will appear, I will have two rocks on a battlefield, which give me additional protection. It takes around a minute for me to kill the first boss, but it's very easy to escape from him, especially with rocks. For the second 3 minutes, after I killed that boar, I made demon blade. And just look how many enemies I hit with blades, and how drones are easily dealing with enemies. From supply skills only 3 are important, fuel, energy cube and power bullet. Fuel lets me to hit more enemies, energy cube helps to hit them more times in a minute, and thanks to power bullet I am doing much higher damage. Before I will meet second bosses, I focus on these 3 supply skills and trying to evolve other weapons. But unfortunately, instead of quantum ball, I made one ton iron. Before bosses will appear, I am standing below a rock to have more rocks on a battlefield. As I told you, it gives additional protection and stop bosses for a second. The biggest advantage here, this map is vertical, so you don't need top skills against bosses like lightning emitter or whistle arrow, because weapons like katana with fuel easily hit bosses on a long distance. The last 4 minutes should have been the hardest, but I was focused on power boot, fuel and energy cube, so as you can see, they made my drones very powerful, and they are doing high damage on a long distance and fast. Demon Blade with Quantables kill the rest enemies. In this map, one ton iron is also doing good damage to enemies, because dumbbells penetrate enemies and with fuel, they hit many enemies on their way. In these minutes, I'm just walking a little up, little down, near grenades and magnet to help them when I'll be fighting with the final bosses. So I had two grenades and when I picked them up, I didn't even notice how one of the bosses was killed. To kill the next boss was very easy. Ok guys, as you can see to beat this challenge, you only need one thing, great katana. As always, don't forget to like this video, subscribe my channel and you can also help me to make more useful videos for you by supporting my channel. How to support my channel, you will find in the description.